it's December, and as we move further down the month, we start to see the gloriously glittery beam of hope at the end of the rainbow, Christmas. But of course, when it comes to celebration, there's more than meets the eye. A house full of loved ones is always a beautiful thing, but then there's the problem of feeding them all. We're going to cook a simple but stupendous menu for this special day, getting you out of the kitchen and into the festivities. You could go through all the fuss and bother of a six course menu, but hey, it's Christmas. Dessert. Sweetness. Sweetness. Christmas. Christmas. Trifle. Right, so we've got two big sponges here. You can get them from the supermarket quite easily and quite inexpensively. This is not going to be your sort of normal run-of-the-mill trifle. Really easy, you just throw it together. It's citrus. So, instead of jam on here, you go, or even soaking it with sherry, you're going to use marmalade. So just come in and take a look. As you can see, I'm doing a little bit of damage to the um, sponge, but that's okay. Don't worry too much about that. Whoopsie dizzy. Don't worry too much about the damage that the um, knife is doing. Just make sure you're getting that all over the sponge. Right, now we'll do this one. Looks like a lot, but quite, in fact, actually, it's, um, you're right, it is a lot, but it's okay, it's Christmas. And plus, you know, I'm being, you know, quite generous. You don't have to use this much. I like this much. Right, so you've used probably about a third of the jar. Now, you're going to chop these. You're going to cut these into cubes. Just use a little serrated edge knife. You can use your cook's knife or you can use a bread knife. Obviously, um... This is not a recipe for, uh, this is not a very um, sophisticated recipe. It's not meant to be. So one, it's the same as the uh, ham, once you've cut lengthways, and you can cut this way. And you've got beautiful little cubes like that. And they taste good too. Now, cut the cubes finish cutting the cubes. It's okay if they look a little bit munted. We're all a little bit munted. Okay. Stop eating the mixture, man. Now, that's not a traditional trifle dish, I know. It's a casserole dish, but I think this is, this is just as good. Start off with some sponge in the bottom of the dish. Put the first one in even, push it in. Then you're going to add some, instead of using custard, you're going to put some lemon curd, which is really lovely. I love lemon curd. Whoops, I'm getting some on my fingers. That's okay, it's Christmas. Mmm, tastes wonderful. Now, because it's citrus, Obviously, you're going to have some orange. Just dot the orange pieces all over the place. You don't have to be particular about anything. And then, just to cut the really sharp flavour of the uh, orange, that orange is particularly bitter um, or sour, you're going to take some beautiful sweet tinned peaches. Now, next layer of sponge. More orange. Oh wait, no. More lemon curd. Ooh, yeah, lemon curd. Mm. 
Little Miss Muffet sat on her tuffet, eating her curds and whey. Along came a spider and sat down beside her and scared poor Miss Muffet away. More orange. More peach. Push it down. Right. Now, this is a uh, Lovely, lovely. Get in with your hands, don't try to do it with a spoon, come on, let's be honest. That's, the, you know, that's dishonesty to use with a spoon and it's clunky, horrible. Right, wash your hands. Dry your hands. Wipe the bench. Okay, now, good. Now that uh, we've got to this stage, we're gonna put some whipped cream. Don't get the mixer out. Don't get the whip, don't get the brrr, don't get it out. Um, who can be bothered doing that? Just, when you, just use one of these. They're not too expensive. Quick taste check. Mmm, good. Now, for some reason, this is giving me a lot of trouble. There we go. Just, you know, let it be, let it go where it wants to go. Oh, you want to go over here? Okay. Oh, no, you want to go over there? Okay, yep, sounds good to me. Yeah, I'm, I'm, you know, I'm going easy. Oh, you want to go over here? Yep, sounds good. Yep. <laughs> Almost like the motorway in certain parts of New Zealand. As it snakes over... Now, do you know what this reminds me of? This reminds me of when we were growing up and you know, you had the beautiful, um, you had your really lovely setup of your computer up front and then you look behind the desk, those are what the wires look like. Okay, now, looks beautiful, it's still not done. Bougie, meringues. Just plop them around all over the place. Don't be precise. Let it be free. Now, not done. Finish off with some sliced allemands. And if you want, you can even put some last little bits of like orange here and there so that they know that there's orange in there. I mean, it should be relatively obvious from the side, but you know, yeah, we all go at our own speeds. Just ask people who drive on the motorway. Okay, so. Um, I don't think it needs anything more. So there you have it. A beautiful citrus trifle.